last year, Nicole got engaged to the man of her dreams. But it's the man set to walk her down the aisle that's been giving her nightmares. Now I'm going to tell you a secret that I don't think I ever told you. You're never going to be like me. Well, one day, you may come home at 11 o'clock at night and say, Nicole, listen to this. I, I, I don't want to have this conversation. So do you think he'll walk you down the aisle at your wedding? Yes, Nicole. I think he will. Yes, Nicole, yeah. I yes, he, Nicole will. he will. There's a lot of times that we don't like things about our parents, but we have to respect that. They're our parents, and, you know, and that, that's how I see it. There but are I a lot of things like I don't like about... But mentality, right? Like, that's that traditional, like, Latino household where you've got this patriarch and you have to accept them because they're the boss. But I think it's important for people to have boundaries too, right? When I left your engagement party, I was like, I get it now. This is not easy. I'm about, I'm about to go to bed with her. I got it twisted, bro. I've been twisted all my life. What do you want me to do? And I can roll and hang with anybody. It was like, wow. Nicole, in therapy, your dad said he'd be open to saying I'm sorry but he never did. to you, but he, just but he refused to say it in the session. I don't session. blame him. You guys are belittling like a grown man. Yeah. Making but he do still that. hasn't. I mean, you know, we, I know somebody he, else who won't apologize. Like either. Either. Has he? Has he said it? Has he his said it? His actions will say it. He's not going to say the word. His actions will do it. How guys, hard is it, Larsa? Because like, he's I'm, a grown man right. and you're trying a very, like, you know, he's a strong man. And he's old school. Yeah, I wouldn't do that I felt bad when I saw that scene because I was like, he's there. He cried to me. That was like, that was sorry. When you cried, that was, I'm sorry. Do you think in an effort to protect her, you isolated yourself from her? I had to, because I didn't know how to do anything else any the other way. But I also feel like it's such a small, simple step, right, to make to show somebody, and it's not just somebody, it's your kid. Nicole, we can't change our parents. We can't change anyone. You just have to accept it, take it, and get the best part of him. That made you cry. Yeah. Why? It's hard to hear people like, just accept him, he's your dad. And so then when like people are like, oh, you're a malcriada, you should just accept him. It's, it's a deep life of things that we've gone through that you guys don't, you know, you don't know. I just remember like being a little kid and I spent a month in the ICU because the car hit me because he was too busy chit-chatting with a friend. You know, like those are the things that I hold on to. Like, dude, what were you doing? You're supposed to protect me and you let me get run over by a car. Like, And as a girl, I also grew up without my father. He left my house when I was seven. It's, it's very hard to understand what's dynamic of having to be so strong out of your life and fight and fight and fight because you don't have a dad to protect you. So I feel you, girl. I feel you. What has your relationship been like since the session that we saw? So we've actually seen Lisa twice more off camera because okay. I think it was really helpful. Yep. And honestly, I'm thankful to the show because I probably would have never, like, Forced I would have just, issue. no, yeah, I would have right. just ignored the I have always room, said that. Honestly, for the rest of my life. But this has, like, forced us to get to, like, a much better place. And I'm wow. honestly thankful to you guys because I probably would have never done the work. I still have not met the girlfriend, but we are spending much more time together. You haven't met the girlfriend. No, Does the girlfriend want to wanna meet you? Apparently, she's very upset. My brother met her, and my brother, and she told my brother that she was mad because I called her a hoochie mama on camera. Okay. Well, understood. How old is she? It doesn't 20, matter. 20 it doesn't matter. That has nothing to do with it. I hate when people put age on everything because age, what does it mean? Nothing. If he's happy, someone makes him happy. It's just right. for me, it's a little weird to, and I'm not trying to be an ageist, but my dad's almost 70. Larsa. It doesn't matter. If what he's happy, a 20 he's, listen, he's going to do with a 70 year old man. Like, it's weird. Yeah. Where maybe bringing her will help your relationship I too. I don't know about that. I, I think it does sometimes because you see, like, the whole dynamic. Like, you're, you're keeping half of his life private and you're accepting 2% of his life rather than accept all of it. Uh